Howdy folks, welcome to episode 5. We're going to continue pretty much where we left off. The sun is coming up. And uh, yeah, I did go back and I cleaned up the tracks as far as um, that one section that was really long and jaggedy. I replaced that with the shorter sections and I chopped up all the trees and that kind of thing. So I did a little bit of cleanup, but I think we're going to continue from where we left off here. I'm going to try putting a switch out here and see if we can get that to happen. Yeah, let's see if we can make this work. So we're going to go like this and we're going to put a switch at the other end. <laughs> she heard me talking. Yeah, see we're going to put this at the other end. There we go. So we can come into here. See if that'll is that gonna oh it's that okay it's that track that's why oh I see where we, we kind of went we went this way because of the because of the ground okay we'll try it again we'll try it with this piece uh, the bridge here or not the bridge the um, the wall we'll try the wall here and see if we can get that to work and that's gonna be down here is it still not gonna? There we go. Okay, let's see how the wall. Oh, the wall looks good. All right, it's not doing it backwards, is it? No, nope. actually, that's pretty nice. Okay, it's like sitting on my mouse. <laughs> Demolish stuff. There we go. Okay, I'm just gonna sit on your mouse. All right, and then um, this one. Let me see. I think we need to put another switch off of here. I'm not sure. Actually, I think what we need to do is we just need to do this. And then, um, yeah, I think this switch is going to need to not exist. I think that's going to be the problem. Okay, let's see if we can get this to come down here. We want this to come down this way. And you know what? Instead of connecting that, why don't we start with track that goes through here, and then we'll worry about the switch. How's that sound? So we're going to go like this. We're going to do this thing. And get this lined up. To the closest degree. That looks like it's going to be it. Yep. Okay. And this is on the crane side. Okay, so we want to come out to about here. And then we're going to go like this. Okay, then we're going to put a switch that goes off to the right. Is that Does that make sense? No, because we need a switch that's going to go off to the left first. And then we're going to go around, I think. Let's see if we can get this to go around. Because what we want to do is we want to connect that to like this type of thing, right? Let's see what that does. <laughs> I love it. Let's try to drive our giant train on that. Um, no, what we need to do is we need to come out this way quite a bit more. I'm going to leave that there for reference right now. But we need to come out this way. And we need to be about parallel with this. See, with ab about the end there. And we're going to come up a little bit. There we go. And then we want to be, yeah, I think that's about right. Okay. And then we're going to try going um, like this and see if we can come around now. See how that curves around. Let's see how that looks. That looks a lot better. And then I think what we want to try to do maybe is have this. Well, let's see. We can come in here and then we can back over. To, see, that's still really sharp, isn't it? Look at that turn. Yeah, it's still it's still really desperate to make that turn sharp. Okay. Because what I was kind of thinking is we could split off up there and then come out this way. 
Yeah, I think that's what we want to do. Let's demolish this track. We're going to come off of this one. And we're going to do this. And we'll probably end up switching that other one for this too, the wall. But we're going to come around this way to this one. Let's see how that looks. Yeah, that's pretty good. And then what we want is we want this to be a, like a turnaround kind of deal. So we're going to extend this straight outward, or at least outward to where this other one is. So let's go like this. I'm kind of wanting to like, you know, get back to driving trains and stuff too. <laughs> so, but yeah, we want to come out as close to this as we can without actually, you know, yeah, there we go. Let's see how that looks, because we can change the we can change the angle and the, the height. I mean, um, so what we want to do here? Let me let me double check and make sure that's not underneath the ground. No, it's not. Okay, we just, we don't have big rocks here and stuff like that. I ran into a few of those. So what we need to do is go like this, and then we need to do our fixed thing, and we're gonna go like this and then come back. So how, what kind of a, whoops, 40, let's try 35. We're going to do 35 meters and see where that meets. There we go. And then we're going to do 35 meters here. And we're going to see where that meets up. That's actually, wow. That's actually pretty close if we could do it. So I think if we start from this end and do the 35 meters going the other way. So we're going to go like this. We're going to do 35 on this side. There we go. 35 meters. And let me see, that was going up a little bit. I don't know, we'll see. We'll see if we can get this to to work. Because we might have to actually if we can get it to connect. There we go. We might have to come a little bit. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful. That's perfect. Just like that. How about that? Is it going to let me? Oh, I think it's too... It's off the ground somewhere. Well, there it is. Okay. Alright, and then we can go like this. We can get rid of this one. And let's get rid of this one too. And then let's see if we can just make a straight connection here. Let's go like this. We're going to need this one, I think. And then we're going to take off the take off the five. All right, cool. <laughs> nice. There we go. There's our turnaround that's not ridiculous. Okay, and then we can probably do a turnaround on this end too. But I think what we'll do is we'll have... Um, we're going to go out this way a little bit. Yeah, we're going to come out this way before we do any kind of, like, turnaround stuff. And we probably want to... You know what? We're going to we're gonna use the taller one. Because we probably want to go up. We're going to need to go uphill, as you see here. And let's check on our map again. Where the... Uh, see, it's basically due north of us. Yeah, so it's going to be... If you look straight along the track and then to the left. So I think that's it right there. I wish we had, like, binoculars. That would be pretty cool, wouldn't it? It's always... Is it just me, or is that something that's like always missing from games? It's one of those quality of life things that... Okay. We're going to go up at 1%. We're going to do this. I suppose we should be... Maybe half percent. We should be... Uh, 
kind of staying north, right? There we go. Because we're going to have the switch. Yeah, let's do 1%. We're going to have the switch come off to the left. So we're going to go like um, this. We're going to do this one. And then this should be able to... We should be able to get... Whoops. We should be able to get this track all the way up to here. So what do we need? How high do we need to go? What do we need to do to put the you in this rail? What do I need to do? <laughs> Apparently I'm a rail salesman now. All right. <laughs> there we go. And then we're just going to come up to there. So we don't need to go ridiculous amounts. And then we're going to this is going to be our next thingy. Is that one the same? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, this is still going up at 2.5%. Wow. It felt like it was level, didn't it? Let's see how long that 2.5% is going to last here. It looks like it's going to take us... Okay, why don't we do this and see what kind of... Is this going to be 2 point? See, it's, it's going to level off here. Aha. Okay. So it's going to level off here. We're going to go like this. That's perfect. I love that tiny little bit of curve in there. When you get them perfectly straight, it's it just... It's, I think we've had this discussion before. <laughs> right? Many times. Okay. 1.5. Alright, 1.5 looks like it's about our amount. And we're going to go like this. Okay, so the other thing we need to do is we need to make sure that we're actually going to come off of this and curve and all that stuff too. So why don't we come up here and start coming back and meet in the middle because this is going to be the more drastic. Yeah, see, we may not be able to get away with going flat all the way up because then we're going to hit that cliff. So, oh man, this is going to be fun, isn't it? All right, let's go like this. And we're going to hit this edge here. That's perfect. Okay. Like this. Oh, this is the drop-off point, too, so it's a little bit easier as far as that goes. We're going to do that. Let's extend this out. Whoops. There we go. How's that look? That looks pretty good. Okay. So that's our thing. Let's take this one back out because we were doing 1.5, which was kind of dumb. Right? There we go. And then we're going to go straight with this instead of uphill. There we go. Straight and not uphill. go like this a little bit. Okay, so now we're going to go off to the right. So we need to take like a big 90 degree curve. You know what? We're going to use the wall and we'll probably replace it with a three or whatever, but I think what we're going to do is we're going to do a curve here. see where is this going to be that looks like it's about right see that's where we want to be facing about south approximately south that's perfect like that okay that's beautiful and what was our what was our radius for that I think our radius might have been a little tight. What, what was it? It was 57. Yeah, we can make that a wider radius, I think, because we can come out over here, right? So if that was 60, we could probably make that about 70, 80, 90, something like that, 80, 90. Let's see what we can get away with. And 
you can as you can see we don't need the we don't need the wall for that to hit this so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go let's try 90 91 let's see what 91 does we don't have like a little lip over this do we it doesn't look like it okay cool and is that going to get us to our south facing there we go that's what I wanted something like that that looks really nice okay so where is our let's put our tower up here just so we can see and we're going to get rid of this one. And then we're going to come back down here. We'll see where our rails come up. See, we're going that way. We need to aim that way more. Okay, cool. So let's do our tower here. And then we're going to come back to this way and we're going to come down this hill. Because this is our biggest thing that we need to worry about I mean we could even instead of doing that rounded curve we could like come all the way out to here to get a little bit smoother downhill but I think this will this will do fine this will be fine so we're gonna go like this we're gonna do our fireproof red oh you know what we did that why don't we do old and we're gonna take off that thing no, you know what? Let's continue the curve. And we're going to go down hill and see what our 3%. Why don't we do 3%? Okay. And how's that look? We're going to make our curve wider. A lot wider. That's still pretty. There we go. 4%, I guess, is going to be our thing, isn't it? Okay. And so is that going to aim at our... For the most part, yeah. Okay. We'll try that. We're going to connect to this. And then we're going to take off our... Whatchamacallit. Our straightening thing. There we go. Which way are we looking? We want to be pointing pretty much at it. Why is it doing the twisty thing? And let's go back to 3%. Yeah, why is it doing the twisty thing? It's not doing it on this end, is it? No, it's not. Okay. So we're going to come down to here. We'll see if it continues to do the twisty thing. When we when we sit it down. Is it going to do that? It's just not going to... Okay, it's just not going to go at all. <laughs> Alright. Let's see how this looks. Does that work well, the transition there? Yeah, that looks like it works. Okay. See, we're coming a little bit too far, too. Okay, why don't we just... We don't need the, the constant, which we'll call it, curve anyway. So we're going to go like this. We're going to switch this to that. We're going to stay at minus... Four percent. And then we're going to be facing this way and let's see if we're going to do that then we don't need to come down this far all right so if we do that three percent is going to get us it just seems a little high up i think we will stay with the whoops four percent we're going to stay with the four percent and then we're going to do this kind of thing we're going to come down 
like this. Okay, and that should give us room to level off. Let me see. Um, three foot rail. Can we put this one up here? It looks like it. Okay. And let's see what this does when we connect this. Where is it? There we go. I just wanted to see what kind of slope we had on it, but it looks like it's not going to be too bad. Now, is that going to smooth? Yeah, that's going to smooth out. Okay, beautiful. Good. That looks like it's going to work. Okay, cool. So then we can go get the we can go get the engine. Let's do this. Let's demolish these two things. Um, facilities. This one and this one down here, and then we can go get our train. Then we should be good to go. We can we can bring our first load up to the iron mine. Now, do we need hopper cars? We need hopper cars. I don't want to take hopper cars all the way down here twice, right? So I guess we need to buy some hopper cars and get those moving too. And this one is going to be that way. Yep. And this one's going to be this way. That looks a little... <laughs> that looks like it needs to be reconnected. Let's try that. Let's do that before we... Rails. Before we do this, let's go like this. Let's get our wall. We're going to reconnect this. Because that way it does the smooth transition. There we go. Okay. Now, if I'll, I'll, we'll go back and show you. For those of you who don't know why I did that. But you saw how it was jaggedy before. Now it starts out flat and works its way up. Because this thing has to sit flat. So now it sits flat and works its way. It actually is a lot nicer that way anyway, isn't it? It's a lot lower. We could even take that out and put in the, whatchamacallit. Okay. Oh, and you know the other thing I wanted to do real quick? is I wanted to replace this one. We're going to replace this one with this. With this rail. So that we don't have... There we go. So that we don't have the stuff sticking into the... thing sticking into the stuff. <laughs> yeah, that. Okay. Cool, I think we are good, so let's go back. That's a lot of track, isn't it? Let's go back to here. And let's check our engine. It looks like it's still hot. 26, yeah, I did come back and stoke the firebox while I was doing that too. Oh, are we on that? There we go. <laughs> you hit R and it goes this off to the side. Here, you hit R. It goes off to the side, and then when you look, you're like looking from beside yourself. <laughs> okay, anyway. Yeah, we're going to get some hopper cars and do this. Let's go like this. Um, locomotives. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. It's 15? Yeah. Whoa, what's that one? Gondola. Huh. We got gondola cars now, too. We're going to do that then. That's cool. We're going to order three of those. Maybe, should we just order like one of each? Or, um, yeah, let's do that for now. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We're going to do one of those. Hopper. And we're going to do. one of the other ones. There we go. Drop bottom hopper. Okay. What paint jobs do we have? I think we'll take the, that one right for right now. Okay. So let's get these 
lined up on here. Can we do it? There we go. First one, whoops. There we go. And we're gonna put in the pins on the front end of the cars. Take out the brakes. We're gonna do this one. Gotta look up here so we don't drop it on the track. <laughs> there we go. And take out the brakes. And then, where'd the other one go? Oh, it's up here, okay. Rerail. That. Let's go up here. Can we fit that in the middle? I don't think we can. Whoops, wrong rail. There we go. All right. Put our thing on that. Okay, and the brakes are on. All right, we should be good to go. Let's see. All right, let's do this. Back up a little bit. And take off our brakes. And I think I need a little bit more volume here. There we go. There we go, let's get back there and do these pins. And then we're gonna need to, yeah, we're gonna need to turn off the regulator. And hopefully we don't go off the end of the track, <laughs> right? And this one. Whoops, come on, you can do it. You can do it. There we go, okay. Take off the brakes, yeah, we got plenty of room. Cool, zero, zero, it won't tell me how much. Okay, well let's go do this. We're gonna need a lot of room on that iron car, aren't we? Or on the iron mine. We got the iron cars on the back instead of on the front. All right. Make sure our switch is Correct. Yep, our switch is the right way. Oh my, that's why. Okay, take the regulator off here a little bit. This is gonna be a really fast curve. There we go. I can't believe we're already going 20. That was fast. Generator. Cool, we get to drive at night. Our two minute night. Sun's going down. Is this gonna make it up the hills? I hope so. That's our first 4% hell. It looks kinda iffy, doesn't it? <laughs> we might have to leave the hoppers at home. Uh, we've got hoppers at home. Hoppers at home. And hopefully that's, yeah, that's the one that I chopped and it moved. I don't know. I tried to chop it again and it didn't disappear or anything. So now it's not a, it's a non-blocking deco item. Oh, maybe that's why. Probably go faster if we give it, give it uh, more regulator, huh? That's why. Okay. gonna watch this. We've got um here, let's do this too. Let's see if that'll help. Now we can see that our cars are on the back. Okay. What's the sky look like? There we go. Oh well, that's cool. Midnight Express, right? What is it? Why? Yeah, there we go. How about that? That's cool. All right. That looks pretty neat. 
Let's see what we've got as far as... This is mostly, I think this is mostly just going to be straightaway. Let's see if we can get some more speed built up here. There we go. I just don't remember where, where all this track goes, so I'm just kind of paranoid about like we come flying up on in the sharp curve or something. That's why I'm kind of taking it easy, but at least we got this map up here so I can see what's up ahead. That was kind of scary because I couldn't see the bridge. It just looked like we were going to fall off a cliff. Alright, are we starting to... Yeah, we're going up the hill. Okay. Let's see if we can our speed here. Yeah, it looks like we're going to be able to hold our speed on the uphill. Okay. Yep. I think we can do it. Nice. This is honestly, this is a lot. It's just longer and not as um, grueling as the uh, the one on the original map on Pine Valley. With the Pine Valley map, that's pretty brutal. As far as the mountains you gotta go across in order to get up there and stuff. Alright. Are we already up by the other thingy? I think we are. where we are on the map. Yeah, we're starting to gain some speed here. I think we're going downhill here. Okay, so we just got to watch the brakes. Wow. Alright, I think we're good on that. 33. Okay, we're, we're keeping our speed. 32. Feels like we're going faster than that, but yeah, I think we're doing okay. Maybe break just a little bit. Nah, we're fine. There's our big iron bridge. Oh yeah, we're starting to go downhill again. Okay. 43, 32, okay. There we go. It looks like we need a little bit of break here. Is this our yeah, this is. Cool. We're already there. That's a lot quicker than I expected. Cool. Okay. Take off the brakes for right now. Alright. We're going to hit a little bit of brake here just to go over this. We don't want to go over the switch at 40 miles an hour. Alright. That would be about 64 kilometers an hour for those of you on the metric system. There we go. We'll reverse her back. Oops. Regulator. I'm going to take it off there. Wow, that's a little excessive speed there. A little excessive on the speed there. There we go. Alright, especially when we're coming through town. Okay. Cool. Turn off the bell. See how we do on this thing. There we go. Beautiful. That was a lot quicker than I thought. I thought we were going to take forever to get out here. But no, this, this one goes pretty fast. Cool. Then we just go across the plains. It's a big plain, isn't it? I guess we can turn off the generator. We don't need the lights during the day. All right. Yep. This is a this is a little bit longer than it <laughs> feels like it should be, doesn't it? All right. Anyway, let's see if we can get. Speed on here. Let's 
seems to top out about 24, 25, doesn't it? Even when you're on beautiful level ground and stuff. I don't know if that's how the reverser worked, if it was that little of a difference, but anyway, we're going to have to bring it back up. Yeah, we're not going to be able to hold it. Okay, cool. And we'll see if, I don't think we're going to be able to get the whole train past the iron things to get those parts. Eh, maybe we will. I'm not sure. Let's see. Go like this. I'm going to slow down a little bit. Keep slowing down. Keep slowing down. Okay, what do we have? Beams first. Let's get our beams on here. We're going to drop off our beams. Now that we got the big cars, we're going to do this. I think we can drop two cars here. Let's see. Oh, I'm like, wait a minute. I thought we were in the middle of the platform. Yeah, that looks like that looks good. Did we make some money? 210. Really? It didn't give us money? Did you see that? It didn't give us money. Huh. Okay. I think somebody was complaining about that too on the... on the bugs. Okay. Oh, no, it did give us money. It just doesn't update. Okay, it doesn't update on the UI until you close it and reopen it. Alright. No, that makes sense. I know you're saying that doesn't make sense, but it does make sense from a programming perspective as far as, like, <laughs> why you would do that. You're not constantly updating the dollar amount as the UI is open, and you're not, like, checking it every single frame and updating it. But you should check it and update it when it's when you have money added or, added or lost. That should be a function. Okay. Come up to the. There we go. You know what we need to do is zoom in on here. There. No, oh, one level out. Okay. Now we can do this. Unload this one. All right, and then we'll see if we can get our. What you call it? This one is just the worst about showing me the, here, hit F, and then, see, hit F, and then right before I can actually get to the F key, it, it changes its mind. All right. There we go. So we need to get the fourth car up to there. That's the second car. That's the third car, and we're going to end up getting um, pushed back because we've got uh, a slope here. Yeah, I, I don't think we're going to, yeah, we're not going to be able to get the iron cars up there, but we'll see how much iron we produce, and that's going to be our goal for next episode is we're going to have to figure that one out. All right, because we're not going to be able to... We're not going to be able to uh, cheat or anything like that because this mountain... Uh, we could just curve the track. Actually, that's not even that big of a deal. What am I, what am I thinking? All right, so we're going to go forward. A little bit more. We're going to get both of these cars up here. there. Okay, that should do it. That should get both of them on the platform. See? We've got this on the front. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, that's not going to hit it. Okay. We're going to come up a little bit more. See if we can get the F. There we go. Alright. A little bit more.
That looks like it'll work. Whoops. <laughs> Am I? Walking through the tender. Alright. There we go. Four, five, and six. Alright, cool. And that should be using it up and making our iron. There we go, we've got iron. Awesome. So yeah, that's that's what we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to back this off. And uh, I'm gonna have to back this off and then we'll we'll curve this track out. So but anyway, that's gonna be it for episode five. Join me in episode six. We're going to uh, yeah, we'll get that going, we'll get our iron. Maybe we'll even make this like a loop through here. And that comes back. No, that's way too much track to do all of that way too much track to do all that but yeah we'll figure something out maybe maybe make a teardrop turnaround or something like that but anyway yeah that's gonna be it for episode five jeremy in episode six we'll get our iron to wherever it needs i think it's right at the ironworks and uh yeah cool we'll see you then later